Hey everyone, we thought it would be a good idea if everybody had a free Paleo Hebrew Bible, and so we've added one to our website. You can find it at fathersalphabet.com and just click on this Paleo Bible link here. And here is a little screenshot of what it looks like. So this is Genesis chapter 1 verse 1, and it begins Be Rashid. So there is the first word of the Bible in the original Hebrew characters, and here is the transliteration, which is how you would pronounce it, Be Rashid. And this translates to in the beginning. The translation that we used for this Bible is the BSB translation, and we selected this one because it's in the public domain. And we wanted to make sure that we could offer this Bible as a free download and keep the entire work as a public domain work that's for everybody. For mobile and tablet users, we would recommend uh, taking a look at each book of the Bible individually, and that's because the PDF files are rather large. So if you scroll down a bit, you'll see that we've um, completed the first five books here, and the rest say coming soon. So we hope to have um, all of the individual PDFs up within the next few weeks. But let's take a look at Genesis. Just a little introduction. And here's where the scriptures begin. So this is every verse of Genesis in the Paleo-Hebrew with uh, how you can pronounce it and then the translation. Now, if you're on a desktop computer and you can handle a larger file, we do have um, the full Old Testament in a single PDF file. If you scroll to the bottom of this page, and we've also got a free Excel study version of this Bible, which I will show you right now. So I'm gonna head down to the bottom. And this is where you can download the, the entire Bible in a PDF. And this is where you can download the spreadsheet. Now, in order for the spreadsheet to work, you will need to um, install the original Hebrew font. So this is the font that allows the, um, the original Hebrew characters to appear. Um, so these characters here will only show up if you install the font. So I'm going to install the font on this computer and then download the spreadsheet so you can take a look at what it looks like. Not everyone is into spreadsheets, so hopefully the PDFs suffice. Um, but if you are interested in maybe doing word studies, the spreadsheet has uh, information on Strong's numbers, um, a King James version translations, and I'll, I'll show you all of that in just a second. So let me first download this font. And I'm using a um, Windows computer. I actually have no idea how to install a font on a Mac, uh, but if you want to find out, you can take a look at a video on YouTube. I'm sure there are tons of them showing you how. On Windows, it's pretty easy, so I'm just going to extract this zip file. And then here's our font. So I'm going to double click that. And then there's a button up here that says install. Okay, and that is it. This font should now be on the computer. So now I'm going to download the spreadsheet. And here's what it looks like. So you'll notice that the, uh, the first part of the spreadsheet is identical to the uh, PDF version of the Bible. And what we've added is the, the King James reading. So uh, Genesis 1, 1 reads, in the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. Uh, Bereshit, bara Elohim, et hashamayim, ve'et ha'aretz. And here it is in the Paleo Hebrew. Be, Rashit, Bara, Elohim, Et, Ha, Shamayim, Ve, Et, Ha, Aret. So let's say you wanted to um, do a word study on uh, Bereshit. 
So if you look over to the right, you'll see the Strong's number, and then this is the um, the Strong's, the Hebrew root word. So the root word for bear reshit is just reshit. And um, let's say let's say we want to see every instance of the word reshit that is in the Old Testament. I would use this little filter here, and I'm looking for Strong seven two two five. Now this is a pretty large spreadsheet, so you'll have to uh, give it a little bit of time to compute. And there it is. So I'm just going to scroll over a bit. Um, and that's so I could show you this side of the spreadsheet. So here we've got every single uh, verse where the word, the Strong's root word, Rashid, appears. Um, this is how it's translated in the BSB. And then here's the corresponding um, King James verse for the use of Rashid. So we know that it's in Genesis 1.1. You'll also see it um, being translated as first fruits in Leviticus 2.12, for example. To undo the search and put things back in order, we would just go back to the same little filter that we used before and click this button that says Select All and click OK. And now it looks like it did when you downloaded it. So this uh, spreadsheet is a work in progress. I am, um, I'm hoping to, to have it be something that I myself would use and that we can all use. Um, so if you have any ideas, suggestions, feel free to let us know in the comment section. I'm going to be using this spreadsheet in my own studies um, for the next at least month or so and hopefully making some improvements as I go along. And if we can do anything uh, to speed it up, then we will certainly do that as well. We will also probably be using this Bible to do some readings together on the channel. Uh, so we hope it, it's a helpful resource for you. Uh, again, it is free. It is in the public domain. It's for everybody. And um, we hope that you are blessed by it and that it helps you to further enjoy your time with Father. See you guys.